The backup on tape consists of three steps that are all automated. Hi, my name is Andreas Hense and this video is part of a series on resource patterns in YAWL. Today we talk about automatic execution. The ability for an instance of a task to execute without needing to utilize the services of a resource. You can see the behavior in the following flash animation. So here we have a completely automatic execution. We start by get tape identity and this is done by backup tapes database. Then we request tape load. This is done by web service. And then we do the backup. And this is done automatically by the backup system. In YAWL, this can be implemented by automated tasks and codelets. Codelets are Java classes that can be defined in an IDE and deployed in the YAWL engine. There is a tutorial on how to do that and I'll put a link in the description below. Here in the example, I was lazy and used the predefined random weight codelet for each of the three tasks. So here we can see in the YAWL editor we have a workflow with three automated tasks, get tape identity, request tape load and do backup. And all of them are done with a random weight codelet. And let's see what happens in the log when we start this case. So now the case is started. So now the first work item has been completed. Get tape identity. The second work item has been completed. And the third work item has been completed. Thank you for watching.